Well, ladies and gentlemen, we'll keep you updated on the uh, travels of Mr. Monday Night, Rob Van Dam. And here's another young man that certainly is excited about making his WWF debut here on WWF Raw. We're talking about young Scott Taylor. Oh, Leaf Cassie attacking Scott Taylor. And, well, this match is, Cassidy is absolutely off his beam. He's what? Well, he's a little nuts. Quite frankly, Scott Taylor, young kid in his early 20s, grew up in the state of Maine. His dad's a carpenter. His, Whoa, look at this. His, his mom works at a convenience store, King. He's just from good old everyday folks. He's a, he's a young kid looking to make his mark here in the WWF, perhaps in the light heavyweight division. Well, I don't know if you'll have any luck doing it here in Mobile, Alabama. I saw a convenience store down here. Look at this. Whoa. Oh! Taylor. What's he doing? Well, a, a slingshot to a cross body with Liv Cassie right out there on the floor. Taylor's dream as a youngster has always been to be in the WWF and much like mankind. And folks, you want to hear some stuff that'll set your hair on uh, on end. Mankind talks about his career as Cactus Jack. There's a cross body. And we'll have part two of that uh, interview with, Cat with uh, Mankind, I should say, well, he had right that here next week. Mankind has that happy face on his shirt. If you ask me, he's a few fries short of a happy meal. That guy ain't right. How was it doing that interview, Ross? Well, it's, it, wasn't, it wasn't fun. That's probably the most terrifying situation as the interview ends, as you will see. Huh? Well, I'll tell you more about it. I'll tell you after we go off the air. It wasn't pleasant. Oh. Look at that drop kick. Whoa, what a height on that drop kick. I bet that made your convenience store mother proud. Leaf Cassidy. She's probably right. ringing up some cigarettes right now, a couple of six packs of beer for somebody. What's right wrong now? with working in a convenience store? What's wrong with his daddy being a carpenter? There's nothing wrong with that. What's wrong with him getting his brain beat out here on Monday night? Huh? Nothing. His uh, wrestling influences, talking about Scott Taylor, Owen Hart and Shawn Michaels, and they're two great role models to, to look up to as far as their in-ring uh, actions are concerned. Uh -oh. ah, throw him off, whoa! Oh, whoa, oh, Lord! Did you see this kid just bounce off the canvas? <laughs> what a whiplash effect by Leaf Cassidy Beautiful. on young Scott Taylor. And we are still awaiting the arrival of Brett the Hitman Hart, who will reveal his secret. Oh. There's a face first suplex. One more time, yeah. I wonder if his mom is watching on TV or she has to watch one of those little surveillance cameras in the convenience store. Uh oh, look out! Taylor counters. Scott Taylor's got no Leaf rolled up. No way! And Scott Taylor upsets Scott. Leaf Cassidy. He must have watched that idiot Bob the first look Holly while ago. Every time Cassidy gets on a roll, he goes nuts. Look at that! What are you doing? Well, go get some help in your friends. Well, it's been all over me, the dude. He's going comfortable. Well, I, I'm disheveled here. Yeah. Hey, listen. I, I guess, guess I'm getting worried in my ear. Apparently, Stone Cold Steve Austin has found him.